Hey guys, how are you? So welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to do a haul video. I went to Mallorca last week. I've been home for a couple of days. So I thought I could film a haul video. I didn't shop that much, but I always think it's fun to do haul videos and watch them. So I wanted to do one anyways, even though I don't have that much to show you, but I am going to show what I got. We went to Palma over the day because we were staying in Alcudia. But we took the bus, it took about an hour. I did not buy as much as I thought I would. I went into Sara because I know Sara is more it's cheaper in Spain than it's here in Sweden. I didn't find anything, but I did find one shirt at Mango, which is the striped top and has these really cute, fun sleeves. And this one was 20 euros or was 19.99, but it's basically 20 euros. And it's really, really cute. I really love it. It's very like classic, but fun with the sleeves. So really like that one. And then while we were in Alcudia where we stayed, we went to the harbor and they had some shops there. And I went into one store. I have to check the label because I don't have the bag left. It's called something inside the store because all the label says inside woman collection. I have never heard of this shop before. It says uh, on Instagram it's called inside shops or on all social media. Never heard of this brand before but I did have a lot of cute stuff. So I got this off the shoulder ruffled striped top which is so so pretty and then there are these two little things here to tie it in the waist. I just love it. I'm in love with the off-shoulder trend. I just love it. And this one was priced at $16.99. It was originally $19.99, but then it was $16.99. So just a little bit of this kind of Really cute. Then I also got this skirt. It's a regular black jersey skirt, but it has these little zippers here. It's always good to have skirts like this. And this was priced $7.99 and originally it was, well I can see, but $7.99 now, so 8 euros for a skirt, which I thought was a very good deal and it feels very comfortable. And then I couldn't resist these. So, so cute. These little white high-waisted um, crochet, can you say it's a crochet or like lace shorts. Uh, they have a little tie with tassels here and what I loved about these is they are short but they are not as super short as other type of shorts which look pretty much exactly the same as these are always so short so I like that these were a little bit longer because I don't like to show way too much so this was originally $14.99 but I paid $12.99 why do they do always that 12 99 So you think it's 12 but it's really 13 Like, yeah, so 13 euros. Really cute. So that was all of the clothes I got. And then the last things I have to show you are a few makeup products which I got from Kiko. We also have Kiko in Sweden now. There are two stores then uh, here in Stockholm. Um, I always like to go into them anyways if I'm abroad because you're, they can be a little bit cheaper there. Uh, but this one I got on sale and I do not remember the prices but I think I paid about 4 or 5 euros for this. This is a multicolor blush in the color 01 Loving Pink Flame. And the packaging is so cute that it comes in tissue paper. When I open it up it looks like this. And look at the inside, so so cute. Did you see? So cute. There are some hearts and some different colors in here. You can maybe just use one or swirl your whole brush, brush in them and just uh, all the colors mixed. So pretty. Couldn't resist getting that. So I also got this Cream Crush, long, cream crush uh, Lasting Color Eyeshadow in the color 02. And I have not tried this yet. I have only swatched it. But it looked like it was a very opaque color and yeah, as you can tell, it's a very light pink which I'm gonna think it's gonna be very pretty uh, to use on the eyes. So the next thing I got was this long lasting stick eyeshadow 
less is better in number one. I think this was also a special edition collection. I'm not sure what it was called uh, because I don't have the box left, but I think it was something called uh, 20th anniversary or something like that. Um, but that was also on the sale. On the sale because it, a Kiko comes out with different collections all, all the time, uh, all year long, and uh, they always sell them out uh, during sales uh, before they take in new collections. So this was something limited edition. So it's if it's still on sale, you can still get it. Otherwise, uh, it's going to be gone. But this was really, really nice shadow. It's very, very light. So it's a great base, and it was really long lasting. So. This really pumps up any eyeshadow you put on. If you have anything other which is light, it's gonna pop like crazy. So you can put any colors on top of this, and I just felt like they make any color pop. I really, really love this. So if you can get your hands on it, I do really recommend buying this. And then the last thing is a lipstick, which to be honest, is not usually the color I actually go for. But I decided I'm going to try it. And the funny thing is when I say it, I do have pink lips today. But this one is a lot lighter than I have on right now. And it's the creamy lipstick in number 03. It's very light. You see? It doesn't look that light on the hand, but when I did try it on, it looked lighter. But yeah, that was everything I bought while I went to Mallorca. It was not that much, but it was fun to film a haul video because I haven't done that in a long time. And I did, do hope that you enjoyed this video as well. And if you do like it, please give it a thumbs up and hopefully I will see you in my next video. Bye!